Isabella, happy wedding day, beautiful. I thought about typing this because, well, you know, I write like a kid. At this moment, that's the least of my worries, though. In just a few short hours, I'm going to marry the most beautiful woman in the world. Honestly, this is a day I have been waiting on since November 10th, 2017. Before my eyes met your beautiful blue eyes, I was never a believer in love at first sight. However, the night I met you, I knew for a fact I would one day marry you. There was no doubt in my mind that God created you for me. To this day, I still feel undeserving. To be honest, I have no clue how I pulled it off. <laughs> You're the most selfless, beautiful, caring, lovely, compassionate, serving, and God-fearing woman I have ever met. Love is gladdened by goodness, always slow to expose and always eager to believe the best. Love is always hopeful. Love goes on forever. You chose these scriptures to be read at your wedding. And what a great example of what you should be for each other. I have no doubt, having met you and talked with you, that this is what you're gonna be and this is how you're gonna live your life. Family and friends, we're gathered here today on this beautiful day, matched only by the beauty of this wedding party, to celebrate something God has done and something God is doing. Coleman, you may now kiss your bride.
and gentlemen, Mr. and Mrs. Coleman Lett. <laughs> Ever think about it? How people fall in love. It's not the way that they look. That's for movies and books. It's a feeling that creeps inside. It ain't the fancy kind. It just builds over time and holds the spirit together when it tears. It's what I got inside. It's what I live and I'll try to give you all of my life, honey. I love you like the real thing. With your wrinkles and your scars, you don't have to hide. Tell me something about your heart. Ooh, that sugar sweet, you got what I need. Sipping on the potion, all that good emotion, just my kind of heat. Just to buy the potion 